beast of peace was dead. I walk around with the strength of a hundred men. You must have run before I tell the ten. Blood dripping from my canine like a fountain pen. It seems I've been asleep for a thousand years. The way my water changed, it brings me a thousand tears. Prince of darkness, they walk through the rays of light. To this beat of empire, I'm the prototype. The shape shifting mirror image flash prototype. The everlasting division, the red blood on tight. Born perfect. And just like the great white shark, the sky is never ending. Okay, Mr. El Gringo Dog. I got your personal message about my knives being a little dull. But when you started talking about my chicken legs and my white shoes and my style, that took it a little too far. So you're going to have to put up or shut up. I'm going to bust out some knives. We're going to show you how it's done. Are you up to the challenge? Okay, dog. This is my fillet knife. DNA might really appreciate this baby. A fillet knife. You're going to have to outdo my fillet knife. That's sharp. What's up? Take the French fries. Take the French fries. <laughs> That's all you got? My kitchen meat cleaver sharper than that. You know what's funny? That's the best you got. And my grandma's got a butter knife that's sharper than that. We got a little uh, Kershaw. I don't know. I didn't plan on taking this guy out, but this is my little everyday carry folding. Even my Kershaw's got more uh, sharpness than your grandma's knife, man. I ain't got it wrong. There we go. Your grandma's knife. I tell you what you can do with your grandma's knife. Come over here and bring it to the recycling center. See if you can get 50 cents for it. <laughs> don't be pulling out your grandma's knife. My blade went right through that apple so fast it didn't even cut it. Damn that sharp. <gasps> Look at that. Nope. Got it. Got the charade old timer. Sharp finger, back when they used to be made in the U.S. of A. Oh! No go, no go, no go! It cut so fast through it, it <laughs> held all the water in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot. Get the action going. <laughs> Here we go. Up. Let's try a machete test. Ripe fruit's one thing, but a ginger ale is a whole different ball game. Now you've seen it chop through wood, but have you seen it kill a ripe melon? I don't think so. Top that, Mr. El Grande Dog. Thin slices, thin slices. Good job. Ooh, thin slices, thin slices. Thin slices. Woo! Clean cut. What do you gotta say about that, Mr. Deep Fried Chicken? <laughs> Woo!
We're gonna try a two can cut. Alright, for the grand finale. Big Daddy Blade. Beat five cans and I'll buy you lunch. Five cans. I'm a professional can killer. Well, El Grande Dog, I hope that made your day. It's hard being a professional Coke can killer. What you gonna do? Welcome back to the Hog Zone.